guys, Zuljan here, and welcome back to another episode of Dark Quest 2. Man, I've got some cool stuff to show you. I've been playing around a little bit. Look at the amount of potions that I have here. I want to show you something really, really cool. <laughs> so the game is designed to where you can revisit a lot of these places, okay? So you'll see all of these places that I've done so far have completed. Well, this one that we did a little while back, the Southern Pass, I did, it says completed too. And I just finished this one, the Knight's Guardians. Now, what you'll notice is that every time you complete one of these places, it becomes a little bit harder. Um, and pretty much you can say that every creature that you're going to face have extra life tacked on them. So I already lost the archer here, but I want to show you something that I thought was really, really neat. So you go in here, you start up the adventure, and you kind of know what the layout is. The layout doesn't change. It's not randomly generated or anything like that. Uh, if it is, it's done, and once it's once it's generated, it's decided for the rest of the time, no matter how many times you revisit it. All right, so there's an easy encounter in here. But look, these guys usually have like four hit points. This guy has six right now. All right, so that's uh, that's significant, believe it or not. <laughs> that is significant. All right, and I'm thinking... I hope he doesn't hit the monk. Thank goodness. Okay, miss. There we go. And he's toast. Good. So, you collect a little bit of the gold. Oh, I was supposed to um, check that with my dwarf. Because of the high perception. Okay, we missed anyway. And we'll go into this next room. And now, the advantage of being going through a dungeon a few different times is I know exactly what to expect. Like, there's a spike right here. Okay. See that? <laughs> See that, man? So once you actually establish um, where you want to go, you go. And there's a potion bottle that's very, very easy to get. Y'all saw that one battle that I went through, right? There we go. Potion bottle. Now, I've collected 100 gold and one potion bottle. If I hit surrender, it's going to say... Um, any items you found will be lost, but you could keep all the magic pots you have and 50% of the gold. So, <laughs> now I have seven pots. Let's go back. Now, I'm not going to do this over and over and over again for you guys, but I really want to test whether or not, um, we have the ability to, well, if that thing gets bigger. If that, if that one fight gets larger and la larger, because sooner or later, it would probably be like... 10 bars of health, you know, which would probably be devastating. All right. Let's go through here. We'll see the fight. And this guy has... Nope, he still has six. That's that's amazing, man. That is amazing. In fact, knowing that, I mean, I could just kind of blast him here. <laughs> because I know that I'm just going to go in and out really quick. All right. We're going to try to do a real quest, though. Uh, as soon as I get this magic pot. And I pick up this gold. <laughs> really, really neat, man. So you don't even have to, um... You don't even have to really work on... Anything. Uh, to do this. You know, I mean, you have to be strong enough. A party of three has to be strong enough to get through. Now there's multiple magic pots and plenty of gold in here. Um, but the fights start to get a little bit harder. So I'm thinking that this is just the way to go to, to be able to grind potions and stuff. Anyway, so we've got plenty of potions to use here. Let's let's just get somebody like stupid powerful. Y'all want to get the wizard stupid powerful? Let's do it. Uh, let's see. Magician spells. Learn powers and skills. Okay, uh, so let's do illusions. We have illusions three already. Wall of fire, anti-magic, plus two shields for allies. I really like this. Uh, we'll add, we'll get another one in Hurricane or Tornado. Invisibility makes the party invisible, allowing them to escape rooms. I have to actually cast that. Uh, let's see. Let's look at the dwarf too, because the dwarf, poor, poor guy, you get seven to, you get extra gold with this one. Shield block, I like that. We use him so darn much. Counter Bash, we'll use that too. And this is Taunting Barrels. 
Two barrels adds thorns that cause damage. Uh, I like this too. Uh, or wait, what is this first? Deflect? Oh, baby. I kind of like that. All right. So you can see, <laughs> I, I could spend a lot of time uh, in those dungeons and stuff. Really, really going at it. So until I could spend this money, which I don't think I can yet. Let's see. I want that gem of immortality, but that's a lot of gold to save up here. We do have the option to buy a couple things. Book of Magic. Increase all magic damage from your spells and abilities. Do we have two items on the wizard yet? Show equipment. The wizard. Yeah, the wizard has that teleportation wand. But I don't use that every single place. I've only used it actually in one specific place, to tell you the truth. Uh, so let's uh, let's buy that other book, shall we? Not show equipment. Buy. Craft. Yes, that's what I want. Okay. Um, book of Magic. Plus one to all damage. There was another one, too, that I wanted to look at. No, I think this is the one that I'll buy. 218. Very good. All right. So we don't need to go to the tavern with anybody. We'll go ahead and move this right here. All right. The wizard is deadly. This can only be used by the wizard or the monk. The monk already has a book of spells. Grants plus one charge to every ability. That's crazy, man. Um, and also the Pendant of Life. Yeah, I think we want to keep that setup on him. And this setup is pretty good right here. This setup is good right here. All right, very good. Um, we do need to buy, I think I need to buy one potion for the dwarf here at least. Yeah. 120. Uh, character additional turn. We might as well just max it out here. Might as well max it out. Now we can raise the dead on old girl. It's going to cost us like seven gold. <laughs> and we're good. Okay. Okay. So, are we going to do... Are we going to do... Let's do the Hall of Black Mirrors since we did the castle last time. Let's do the Hall of Black Mirrors. Uh, the dwarf's going to come in. The... I think I'm going to go ahead and bring old girl back in too. Or do I want to bring the monk? I mean, I really like this. I wish the, <laughs> I wish she had the ability to look at traps. There are some boots that uh, help show traps, but they're only for the archer or the dwarf, which makes it kind of um, hard. All right, let's go with this. I'm going to have a little bit of faith here and see what we can do. And if we can't again, well, I can just off-screen a bunch of... Um, looting so to speak now look at this we have magic shields and everybody because of uh, those perks that I took oh man yeah this is gonna work out really good really good chaos shall prevail I doubt it Beretta um, let's see I need to see if there's any spikes here I don't think so two damage the wizard is just going to kill him. Perfect. All right. Now we go through the door. First room, done. Easy. Uh, this is death. <laughs> I just took off the dad gum. Oh, man. I just took off the stupid wand. The bad thing is, this happens no matter what, right? Like, no matter what. I cannot believe this. There's no other way to go, is there? <laughs> no other way to go. Well, rip. Rip, rip, rip. Um, I'm guessing I'm just going to try the Dark Monk. Don't die! Oh, it didn't kill him. It just summoned another dark monk. Oh, I'm I'm okay with that. I am okay with that. Uh, let's see here. What do we want? What do we want to kill this guy with? Actually, voice of madness, chaos wave, friends from the past. 
I mean, I, I think I just... I think I just go smack this guy. Oh. Oh! Oh, the spikes killed him. Good. Good, good, good. Alright, well... It could have been worse. I thought that was death. I really did. I thought you stepped on it and you died. Okay. Four of these wizard guys in here. Uh, let's see. I can go just tap this right now, but I don't think I want to do that. I, I think I want to take the chance of doing that. Okay, so let's voice of madness. No, let's um, let's do friends from the past instead. Oh no, that's not what I wanted to do. Crap. Um, hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't want a lightning storm here. God dang it. <laughs> Son of a gun. I, I really don't think I want to do anything, though. This room shouldn't be too bad. I think I'm going to face a lot worse here. So, lightning? Okay, good. Alright. We got magic shield, I thought. We're supposed to have magic shield. That's clearly magic. Clearly. Okay. Okay. Let's go touch the skull, huh? Nothing happened. Crap. Okay, um... Let's voice of madness... This guy. There we go. Alright. And... Uh, hmm, I think I'm just gonna shoot something. <laughs> Just shoot something. Man. Alright. Um, this is rough already, man. Potion of life. The herbs in the potion make me feel better. Good. You needed to feel better. Okay. Dang, man. <laughs> the dwarf kind of took it on the chin right there. Ouch. I don't I don't see what good the magic shield does if um Oh, I couldn't hit him. If it doesn't shield me from those attacks. All right. Well, this room I clearly underestimated. I clearly underestimated this room. Um the bad thing is I don't really have So we can surrender in the next room if I really want to. And go out. Instead of the dwarf dying. Well, the dwarf dying, though. I mean, it's... It's bad, but... We we only lost a hundred gold or so, or whatever. You know? Oh my god. All right, well, you know what's gonna happen here, then. You know what's going on here. Oh my goodness. Uh, <laughs> uh lightning storm. These dudes are powerful too. All right, I can kill one of them. And I can kill the other one. Chaos wave. No, let's do um do dark fate that heals him at least okay are we gonna do another dwarf I think we do oh no wait 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 that's monks okay we can handle the monk we can handle the monk I like that no maybe we can't handle the monk um do we use illusions right here I think we use illusions all right There we go. All right. 
Good. Okay, the monk's gonna go in this one too now. There we go. Alright. Dang it, man. Should have moved them a little bit closer. Beautiful. I got through to the room. <laughs> barely. Well, not barely, but I mean, it could have been really bad. All right. A few traps here, man. Traps, traps, traps. No? <laughs> the Hall of Black Mirrors. I guess that's why they call this place the Hall of Black Mirrors. Okay, there's... Ooh. Just the kind of place... Just the kind of thing that would make me want to um, bail out of here with my winnings, you know. Got 279. I could literally get out now and still have um, this magic pot. Let's see what this next room looks like first. Hmm. Okay. Again, we could deal with this if it's just one. Yep. I like that. The Dark Monk, only one. I like it. Okay. We do that. And hit him, please. Yes! Finally! That's good stuff. Alright, let's take a right right here. I should have checked for traps first. I see the black mirrors now. Very interesting. Very interesting the way they do that. Okay. Oh! <laughs> Why am I so careless? Why? <laughs> uh, oh, I remember this thing too. Um, well, we could just straight up kill him though. We could just straight up kill him, right? We got two potions out of it, yo. We got two potions out of this place. Oh my. Um, okay. So if I go into this square here, it's the square right here. Dang it. It didn't work. I was going to do Chaos Wave. I could still do it right here. Oh, I messed up. I straight up messed up. Chaos Wave would have been really nice. That this is what I wanted to do. Um, hmm. Okay, I'll tell you what. Let's hit that. We'll go... Oh, well, I was supposed to move first. Dang it, I'm screwing up so bad here. Um, if I kill one... Yes. And I'm going to go ahead and... Well, do I Dork Fate here or do I just attack? No. Um, let's just attack first. Yep. And we can just kill him and we can Dork Fate in another room. All right. That's worth it. Okay. As crazy as this sounds, I'm going to take the mage forward. Hmm. 50% chance to find treasure. Found treasure. Good. This place is probably really big. I haven't checked them out. Oh, no. Um. So, right here, we could do some really devastating stuff. Uh, first of all, let's tornado. Look at this. <laughs> Alright, and uh, we'll dark fate right here. Uh, let's see, to get our stuff back. There we go. And I think we just stay put. Let them come to us a little bit. Unbelievable, that tornado, bruh. 
That tornado did some good stuff. Uh-oh, I'm, I'm scared? Okay. Oh, he is scared, so he can't... I mean, he can use an ability, but that's about it. I can't get close enough to him. We can do... I mean, Armageddon does a lot of damage here, but I can't get him out fast enough. Basically, I would uh, I would have to use Armageddon and then pull one out. I wouldn't have to, but it's going to hurt him. Also, why don't I have potions with these guys? I thought I had potions with them. I guess not. Maybe I used them all. Okay, let's do... I'm not going to do Chaos Wave here or Armageddon. Voice of Madness, I think, is probably the way to go. There you go. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> All right. Um, we're going to go ahead and end turn here. Okay, we can... Path is blocked. Oh yeah, he can't get that far then. Okay, um... Hmm. Okay, we will put you closer because you can evade. I don't know how that's going to help, but... Crap! Oh, this could be really, really bad, man. Really bad. No! Okay. Um, this guy has magic shield on him. So, Inferno will not... Inferno won't kill him. Guys, blaze of glory here. Blaze of glory right there. Um... We got something that we can pull out of here too. He's gonna die if I don't do this. <laughs> Armageddon, baby. Sorry. Oh, the the magic shield. I didn't even think about that. Holy crap, that rocks. <laughs> yeah, hit the monk. Hit the monk. Hit the monk. Hit the monk. Oh my God, and a potion. <laughs> we are literally the luckiest sons of guns in the world. I don't know why I'm going slow. All right. The missing pieces has been found. Soon we'll have all the talisman pieces. I found the talisman piece. I needed like that's that's what I need to go further, man. Yay! I cannot believe we lived through that thing. Holy crap. That that's beautiful. Okay, we have 628 gold here. The dwarf has to be rezzed. I mean, I'll tell you what. Let's look at potions first. Buy potions. Yeah, you definitely need a um, potion. You definitely need potions. Do you have enough for a big one? Um, potion of refresh. Refreshes your mind, allowing you to recast spells you previously used. I love that. Um... All right, now I'm good and broke, <laughs> just like I'm supposed to be. Um, <laughs> does it let me sell? Yeah, it does. Good, I like that. I didn't know you could sell them. That's pretty cool. Um, all right, so now I can go to the Gravedigger. 
Oh, I'm gonna have to uh, go to the inn or something. I'm gonna have to get a little bit of money here. Bring back... Oh, how about this? Can I... Can I sell anything? Did I find anything? I did find something. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Good. Um, now we can go to the tavern. We can go to the tavern. Re not recruit heroes. Rest. Um, he needs to rest. Uh, the, the dungeons are back. Why is it telling me this? I think it's a little bug that I'm getting on my screen here. Okay, those were the only two that needed to rest, right? Yeah, it looks like it. So, yeah. <laughs> I just happen to have something going on. Um, oh, maybe it's the recruit new heroes thing. Yeah, all right. I got it off my screen. <laughs> that was crazy. It was a little visual bug there. Grave digger. Bring back the dead. Resurrect. Beautiful. We have 191 gold left. And uh, we have some potions left to use too. My dudes, I think I'm going to go do a couple of off-screen potion runs. That way, next time we come back, we could spend a few of them. Power up our guys, try to get the next talisman piece, and move on with the adventure. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, give me some dap on that like button to show you support. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Uljin signing off, and we'll see you next time.